All right, what's good? Blake here, Forex Money Flipper with 10 Talents Trading. We're going through CPI because we have CPI news release today. Uh, over uh, somewhere, we got C right here. We have uh, CPI coming up February 13th, Tuesday. That's today, okay? And also, I'm using this right here. We can see we already had a little bit of news come out. But we're waiting on CPI 830. So what I wanted to do was look at the last time that I got to keep an eye on my trade. We got to look at the last, the last. Uh, I'm, I'm, I don't know how many I'm going to look at, but I want to go through uh, some previous CPI news releases. And here we have uh, just as I just took a little screenshot clip of that. A page from the news page and it shows the data and everything um, but right now I'm just looking to see I'm not concerned with uh, numbers or what this that and the other numbers are and stuff like that what I'm wanting to see is just get a feel for the volatility and the reactions and just see you know how really how serious is CPI on the us 30 dow jones and so we have january 11th right here 8 30 and we got it right there that's 8 30 right there january 11th um that was the last one you see not not too crazy all right so we're moving to december 12th and we're gonna Go back, December 12th, we're right here, and I'm just going to look at 8.30 there. We're going to see what kind of reaction we had there. Keep an eye on that trade there. Uh, real quick, let me, allow me to look at uh, where we are. Yeah, I... I I could be wrong, but I feel like there's a good chance that we'll um, uh, keep going up. Uh, the thing that concerns me is, are we going to go down and tap into this level here and sweep all of this, which would be where my stop loss is? Um, so, you know, that could be kind of nasty for a $60 loss there on a small account i can only run that account to 4500 and then i lose the account so i'm trying to baby it back to health but this is what i'm a little bit concerned about the cpi and what might happen and this is why i'm looking to see you know how volatile it really is and stuff like that so 8:30, and it's not that i have not seen plenty of these releases and i was probably watching the market i think at the time it's just that you know a lot of things go down and uh, trading and a lot of trading takes place and it's easy to forget that's why you know, a lot of a lot of people will write stuff down and take notes and whatever but i i'm not too much on that but i probably should be anyway, december 12th 8.30 right here. So that's that. That is CPI. Okay. That's that release right there. That candle right there. Right there. Nope. Right there. That's the candle right there. Okay. So nothing. That's not, you know, too, 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 too crazy there. Um, we could... Uh, even put it like this and try to see if it give us a five minute and have a look see what that looked like so 8 30 pretty fairly nasty right before uh let's see yeah no that's it right there so fairly nasty little uh shock there um I don't know if I'd say that's, you know, too, 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 too crazy, but it's, it's not nothing for sure. Um, 
okay, December, uh, November 14th. Okay. Wow, look at that one. That's pretty se that's pretty severe there. Um Let's see if we can get a 5 minute Yeah. Well, you know, you can see how the market was looking beforehand, right? It was like you probably were zoomed in like this, you know, you're probably you're pro I think I remember uh, it's uh, I don't know if I don't want to say I can remember it cuz there's so much that goes on but um I was probably trading this this one but you know you're zoomed in here you probably you're probably about like that trading it and uh <laughs> you know, it looks like it just swept all this and then just exploded up. Just totally crazy. That was very serious. I think I definitely was trading that. I, it's, it's been a while, you know. It's been quite a while. A couple of few couple of months. Um, but CPI, yeah, it can definitely be dangerous for sure. Um, yeah, and, and that would be the sort of the same thing here, right? Like, I'm zoomed in, you know, it could very well sweep all this and, You know, the, the question is, uh, do you feel lucky? You know, um, you know, do you, how good do you really feel about your analysis, right? Um, we've been going up for a while and, uh, you know, we could continue going up. Um... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to say about that. I mean, we kind of already swept this, right? So you would think, well, maybe CPI might might push us down. Um, the thing is, if you get a move like this and you had your, let's say you had your stop loss up here. I think on this day I was expecting a sweep of this and I think I ended up like taking profits like right here or something. Uh, I had my take profit set or something I think it got slammed into or whatever but anyway if a move like this happens and you have your stop loss I meant take profit say take profit I'm gonna take profit there but if but if you have a stop loss up here and that thing explodes up through there as you know probably know it's um, gonna take you out for a lot more than you than you want to lose okay so there's my trade right now that I'm currently in it's not looking too good it's forming a double bottom might just keep going this is not what I wanted for sure um not the result I wanted. You got some railroad tracks here. That's, I should have seen that, you know. I, I don't know. Well, this video is over because I, I don't want to look away anymore. I want to watch the trade and figure out what I'm going to do.